We are under the lights as the show gets you ready for another edition of Major League Baseball. A good matchup here for you tonight between the New York Yankees and the Texas Rangers. Stay tuned for Rangers Baseball next. Alec Bettinger will be on the mound for the series opener. What do we need to know here, Danny? Hey, one of the things this guy does really well, neutralize the left-handed hitters. On the season, lefties are hitting under 250 against this guy. So whatever he's doing against lefties, it certainly works. Standing in, Attic, Lou Gehrig. The runner right in field, scoring position four. with two gone. Lou Gehrig. Like there, come on. Here's the first pitch to him. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. And that's going to wind up hooking just a bit foul. So a missed opportunity there. Again, another foul ball. Hey, let's go, kid. One time the right 0-2. And an off-speed pitch swung on and missed, and with that, the side is retired. One left for the Yankees. It's the Yankees nothing. Rangers coming to bat on Major League Baseball, the show. Babe Ruth will be the starter in this one for the Yankees. What do you have for us on him, Danny? Hey, Matt, we're getting a chance to look at a guy that's really struggled lately. ERA over five in his last three starts, so he's going to have to really improve on that one. Too many base runners, too many hits, and too many walks. He needs to get off to a good start and maybe throw up a zero in the first Pretty inning. The, Yankee, the right fielder, number four. So coming to the plate, Lou, Lou Gehrig. 0 for 1 here in the early Let's going. Go one of the keys to securing a win they want to keep the pressure on and try to build that lead as much as they can moving into the later innings and the first pitch of the inning here misses down and in for a ball that's one and oh Swung on and belted. <laughs> A solo shot down the line in right. And his power surge continues. And even 60 for him on the year. And just like that, it's now a 5-2 ball game. Well, you can see how pure his swing is, and that's why he's able to hit an incredible 60 home runs this season. Might as well start engraving his name on the MVP trophy because he's having a year for the ages. Witness. Digging in, Lou Gehrig, yeah, and he's the, the reigning right American oh, League player of the month. Yeah, yeah, man, this guy flexed his muscles in that last at bat. We heard that he has good power. That last bomb had to go well over 400 feet. He hit it a long way. Here's a swing and a long drive high in the air and deep to center field. Two-run shot to straightaway center, his second of the game, and the lead is now 7-2. to two. Next for the Rangers, Will Clark. Bad, no hits first to this baseman. point. Will Solak Clark. leads off first with a pair of outs in the inning. Two outs here, two outs here. Pulled toward right center field. Gehrig is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. One left for Texas. They're down five. It's seven to two.
Ready now, Lou right Gehrig. Two, he comes four. in two for three with Lou. a couple of home runs thus Gehrig. far on his line. This guy's having a pretty good week so far in one game. His last at bat is second home run of the game. We'll see if they'll pitch him a little bit more carefully in this A.B. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. And he throws the fastball by him here. 0-1. Hey, this pitcher better be careful right here. My man at the plate is not trying to push something to the opposite right field. Kid. It might be. It could be. It's gone. A home run. <laughs> A solo shot here to straightaway right field. His third home run of the ball game, as it's now a six-run ball game. Well, you have a great night in hockey. You score three goals, and that's a hat trick. But how about hitting three home runs in one night? That's the baseball equivalent of a hat trick, and that's off the... Digging in once again, batter, Nick Solak. 0 for 2 Second from him so far in this one. Solak. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 2 pitch. Hit the other way out toward right field. Right fielder is on the run. He tracks it down and makes the play to record the second out. Lou Gehrig will stride in again as he looks to join a very right elite list. Four. We take you back Lou. to earlier. This Let was home run go. number Let's three in the right ball here, game as he'll try and join just a select few with four home runs in a single game. First pitch coming. Here it is. Driven deep. At the wall, it is gone. <laughs> so it's a two-run shot to right center, his fourth in the ball game, as they've widened this lead to eight now. You know, talk about having a great day. Four home runs in one game. I would say that's uh, more than great. That's a spectacular day. Well, that wasn't exactly a nail biter. But it's always nice when you can get an offensive explosion like that and save your closer for another day. A comfortable victory. 14 to 2, the final score in this one. The New York Yankees pick up win number 70 to top the division. Babe Ruth records the victory his 13th of the year as he turns in eight strong innings of work. Alec Bettinger permitted six earned runs to come across in the losing effort. So that's a wrap here tonight. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and Heidi Watney, this is Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, find us on Twitter, at MLB The Show. Time of the ball game: four hours and two minutes.
We are under the lights this evening as we get you set for another edition of Baseball on the Show. Coming up, we've got a good matchup in store between the New York Yankees and the Texas Rangers. It's Rangers baseball, and it comes your way next. Mike Miner will be on the bump for game two of the series. What do you have for us on him, Danny? Hey, we're getting a chance to look at a guy that uh, is a little bit up and down throughout points of his career. A career ERA just over four. When he's good, he can be really good. And when he's bad, well, let's just say he can be pretty bad at times. But it'll be interesting to see which one we see. He's a little that bit of Jekyll cool. and Hyde. The Hopefully he's going to be a little seven. bit more Jekyll Mickey than Hyde in this one here today. Mantle. All right, one time right here. Here comes the first pitch. Hit in the air out to center field. Mesa will get there and he puts it away to retire the side. The Yanks leave one. It's the Yankees nothing. Rangers coming to bat on Major League Baseball, the show. Chris Sale is on the mound for game two. Dan Plezak, what do you got? Hey, Matty V, we're getting a chance to look at a guy that's been, like, white hot. How about a whip under 1.00 in his last three starts? Not a lot of base runners, and that usually adds up to a lot of success. Let's see if he can continue to do that in this one here today. The first baseman, number So 22. next to the plate for Texas, Will, Will Clark. No official Clark. at bat for him, but he has scored a run in this one. Swing and a little blooper to center. Here comes Manilon for it, but he won't get there. It falls in. And this throw gets away from him. And he is in to score from second as the throwing mistake defensively came back to factor into that one. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And in the bat next, former Dodger minor leaguer Willie Calhoun. Even though they're up by a boatload early on in this one, you can't get complacent and get lazy. They got to keep the gas pedal down because this team that they're playing can strike and score a lot of runs, too. Pulled toward right center field. Mantle is under it, and there's one gone. And with that, we'll give you a quick look at our current standings in the AL East. Stepping up now, Mickey Mantle. Now he flew out in his last at bat. Hey, almost, Matty. Almost went deep Mantle. his last AB. Hey, Certainly hey, just missed it. With this guy's big power, he's feeling pretty good at the dish. Look for him to try and get on something and drive it out of the yard hey. this AB. And that'll get there down for Find a the base ball. hit. Find the ball. Sometimes the first pitch is the best pitch you'll see all at bat. Definitely coming out of his shoes. Aggressive style. First pitch. Base hit up the middle. So striding forward now. Up Lou Gehrig. The, the right fielder. Williams on second. Go. Mantle is over at first with one away. Broken bat as this ball's hit on the ground. All and right, the ball brings up. it in to second for one. On to first, not in time as he just hits the bag ahead of the throw. At the plate, Victor Victor Mesa. As we move the past the halfway point in this one and begin fielder. the bottom of the fifth. Victor Victor Mesa. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Mantle is there, and he has it for the first out. Settling in now, Mickey Mantle. He's one for two in this one. Mickey Mantle. Here's the first pitch to him. Line drive base there hit. There you go. Make the turn. Have a look. The runner from third comes across to score as they try and chip away at the deficit. And he is into second base with an RBI double. 
Just some more of the same from him. He's been clutch all year with runners in scoring position, and he does it again here with a double. Tack on another RBI to his season total. In now, Lou Gehrig. He's hit this in his two at bats right so far. Lou Gehrig. Ground ball right side. Hold up, hold up. On to Clark at first, and the inning is over. A run on two hits for the Yankees. Heart of the order, three, four, and five coming up. The Rangers on top here, eight to one. Hey, you got it. No one better. Coming to the plate now, Mickey Mantle. He's two for three and looking for more Mickey. here. Mantle. See you drive it, kid. See you drive it. First offering on its way. Oh, here's a shot out to right center. Come on, come on. Two, 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 two. Around first. He's digging for second. And he is in the second with a double, his third hit of the night. Now, this is the way you want to start off a series. We haven't even hit the weekend yet, and he's on the board again, this time with a double. This is going to be a good four-game set for him if he can keep this up. Digging in now, Lou Gehrig. 0 for 3 to this the point. Back. Yeah, not right his game so far. Baby, He's such a good hitter. We all kind Gehrig. of expect him to pick up two or three hits most of the time. That's not really how baseball works, though. Hey, have a rip up there right now, huh? Runner at second here with one man out. hit hard towards the hole and that's through into down, left field down, for down. a base hit hey, he beat it. cutting it close here but he comes through in the eighth to extend his hitting streak yeah and he was staring at his last at bat right there probably his last at bat would have been tough to get him another a b in this one but he's able to get it done hey better late than never and i'm sure when he walked into that batter's box right there he's thinking this very well could be my last a b of this game so if i'm going to keep this streak alive going to have to do it right now matthew Here's a fly ball well hit. Going back is the right fielder, but he has no chance to make the play. Stand it's up off right the here. wall. Stand up. And the run is in to score from third. That's a grind pitch right there. Fastball in off the plate, and this batter's able to fight and keep his hands inside this baseball and drive it for a knock. Impressive. So striding in, Mickey Mantle. He looked to keep it going three Mickey. for four so far in the Mantle. ball game. Come on, baby. See it, drive it. First pitch of the at bat. Ball one. Hey, like you can't Bases are empty, up. one man out. That's and he two. won't bite at that one either. It's two, two and oh. No strike. Good one. Fouled off. And he fouls this one off. Drive that pitch, Set huh? to deal on two and two. Got him to reach for it there as this is grounded to short. And there's out number two. At the plate, Mickey Mantle. There are two gone and the possible go-ahead run at first. Mantle. Here's the first pitch. Now here's a line drive, and this is going to get down for extra bases. Go hard. So now they'll have two men in scoring position following the two-out double. 
I think they're way past due changing their approach to this guy. Whatever they're doing strategy-wise, it's not working. That's his third double of the game, so he's feeling pretty good at this one. So a big spot here in stepping the in, white Lou Gehrig, as he'll hit with Blue. the go-ahead run at third Blue. and two away. Hey, clutch up. Your turn right here. Clutch up and drop in right here. The 1-0. Nope. That's inside. Hey, you want to talk about being in a zone? This guy's been raking lately, and it all starts with his pitch selection. Two great takes, and he's almost daring yeah, the pitcher. Just go ahead and challenge off. him. Swing and a liner, but pulled in at the hot corner, and that ends. Next will be the designated hitter, Willie the Calhoun, hitter, attempting five. to, as they say, get off Willie. the schneid here. Calhoun. 0 for 5 so far. Lofted in the air out toward right center. You, 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 take it here. Mantle is there to make the catch, and that means we've got more baseball ahead. So they go quietly here in this half inning. Take a quick walk to keep the blood circulating. 13th inning coming up, and we are deadlocked at 8 apiece. Stepping in, Victor Victor Mesa. He's been Northern great Ranger. lately, and it's resulted the in his being fielder. awarded with the American Victor, League Rookie Victor. of the Month Award. Mesa. The one two. This is skied into short left center. Mantle comes on now, and he has it one down. So here's the cleanup hitter, Mickey Mantle. Right he has the possible go-ahead run only 90 feet away at third base. Here's the first pitch. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Going back is the center fielder to the track. Goodbye, home run. So a two-run shot to left center as they've taken a two-run lead. Coming to the plate now, Nelson Cruz. Now and we'll see if he can the get right something field. into the gap to make it Delta. interesting. He's had a great game so Cruz. far, but needs the triple to complete a cycle. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Mantle calls off the left fielder as he takes charge for the second out. Well, it took about a game and a half to seal this deal, but they took the lead in the top of the 14th and hung on for the road win in the bottom of the 14th. That's a real team builder right there. 11 to 8, the final score in this ball game. New York put on a real offensive show with 11 runs on the board. Cy Young earns the victory in relief in this one, his seventh of the year. Christy Mathewson earns the save out of the bullpen, his 31st of the campaign. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com. Our final line score tonight... First for the victorious Yankees, 11 runs on an even 20 hits. No errors, they left 12 men on base. For the Rangers, 8 runs on 17 hits. No errors, they left 13 men on base. Time of the ball game, 3 hours and 56 minutes.
We are under the lights as the show gets you ready for another edition of Major League Baseball. Tonight, an intriguing matchup between the New York Yankees and the Texas Rangers. It's Rangers baseball next. Colby Allard gets the ball in game three of the series. What do we need to know here, Danny? Kind of a strange outing in his last one, Matt. Was able to pitch into the sixth inning. Wasn't able to complete the inning. It kind of got away from him in the sixth. It'll be interesting, Matt, to see how he bounces back in this one. Striding forward now, the Batting Yankee four. cleanup hitter, Mickey the Mantle. Field, and the Yanks seven. trying to make this first Mickey. inning even sweeter here. Mantle. As a look, now the pitch. And a check swing here, but he clearly oh, went around on a pitch that would have been a strike anyway. It's nothing in one. And, fellas, you take a look at this Rangers team entering play here tonight. Fair to say they're not playing their best baseball right now. Losers of five of their last six. Yeah, Matty V, it hasn't been a very good homestand. And Dero, through the go. first five games of this set, one and four, that's not going to get it done at this level. Yeah, and, and have lost in a variety of ways, whether it be on uh, on some bad. Now at the plate, Michael Young. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half Leading of the first. For the Rangers, the shortstop, Michael Young. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Right fielder giving chase. Two, two. He can't get to it. This one's down. No runner, no runner. Cut hold, cut hold. Man, I thought this at bat was over. Down 0 2. He's able to work himself back into a hitter's count 2 2, and he's able to find the knock out there. Digging in, Nick Solak. And he has been, pardon the cliche, the in Fuego of late. Yeah. Seen that average shoot up oh, wow. quite a bit over the past eight ball games. Young gets his lead at first, nobody out. And no out now. Sent in the air out to straightaway central. Two, two, Mantle two, two. will settle cut under it, it to it, make it. the Hold play for it. the first out as the runner will have to head back to first. Coming to the plate now, Mickey Mantle looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at-bat. Yeah, and he didn't put up much of a fight either, Matty. Got to find a way. Can't go down three pitches. I don't care if you're staring at him or swinging at him. You have to find a way. to make. There's a drive high in the air and deep to left center field. So a solo shot here to left center field, 38th home run of the season for him. And the Yankees take the lead. It's 2-1. to one. Wow, talk about a guy getting hot, right? Hits a bomb, hit one yesterday. Usually when he gets hot, he starts to hit them in bunches. And this could be the beginning of a very, very good hot streak. So one away here with the bases empty. Number and up next, the left-handed hitting first baseman, Will Clark. Will Clark. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. Now here's one hit in the air to the right side. Mazeroski takes charge out there, and he stays with it for the second out. Your Hal Newhouser please. comes in unexpectedly from the pen in relief of his injured teammate. Number 16, Hal Newhouser. Next will be the cleanup hitter, Mickey Mantle. It was a solo shot Mickey. for him in his last at-bat. And that last at-bat when he went deep, he turned around right, a pretty good pitch, fastball. Right so go. I'm kind of thinking this guy's a good fastball hitter. So I might want to move that ball up and down oh. and in and out and try not to throw it right down the middle of the plate. One and oh, the count.
Big swing and a miss at the changeup, a ball and a strike. Hey, this pitcher better be careful right here. My man at the plate is not trying to push something to the opposite field. There you field. go now. Come on now, one time. Lifted in the air to center field. Score, center fielder score, giving on, chase. Score. He's there to make the play, and that'll retire the side. One left for the Yankees, as they're unable to add to their 2-1 to one lead. Mickey Mantle will stride in again, and before he takes his cuts here, let's flash right, let's it back go, to go, the go, third on. inning. Mickey. This was just a solo Mantle. shot, but it definitely helped get right, this offense right here, right going. Now. Let's go. Wait for your pitch up there, huh? First delivery to him on the way. Looked like he tried to pull it there, but he swings right through the fastball. Good thing he didn't make contact with that pitch. Only thing he could do is probably hit that on the ground. It could be a double play ball. Nothing in one count. Here it comes. Ball. We're playing 11. Three runs, nine hits, and one error on the Yankee line score so far. Tried to crush that ball and now perhaps needs to shorten up with two strikes. Hey, you can do it. No one better. Let's go. Driven deep at the wall. It is gone. <laughs> So it's a three-run shot to straightaway right field. His second home run of the game, and it's now a six-to-one ball game. Second home run of the game right there. He is locked in at the plate. You hear so many of today's players talk about rhythm and timing. Well, he is perfectly on time in the heart of the zone. Next to bat will be the Texas cleanup hitter, Nelson oh, Cruz. The and they're down to their final the right four field. outs here, Dan. Nelson. Yeah, it's not looking too good for them Cruz. right now, Matt. They've got a significant hill to climb, but they've got to take it one bat at a time. A couple of it's guys like get on, guy and out. then who knows what could happen. Two out here and a runner at second. Hit pretty well out toward right center field. Mantle's on the move. He can't get there, so the inning will continue. Hit me, hit me. He pulls into go, go, go. second safely. Oh, as oh, also oh. on the play, a run comes across to score. Never say never in this game, folks. It's late and the clock is ticking, but that RBI double might Up start making Rangers. believers out of the, the entire catcher. dugout. We'll Eva. see if they can build on it and maybe run, get back into can. this thing. This is skied into the air to straightaway center. And Mantle makes the catch. The inning is over. It's a run on two hits here for Texas. Ninth inning coming up. The Yankees lead it 6-2. to two. Digging in and looking for more, now Mickey back. Mantle. Two home <laughs> runs already to his name Mickey. in this one, and we'll see if he could Mantle. possibly strike again. See this guy's having there. a pretty good week so far in one game. His last at bat is second home run of the game. We'll see if they'll pitch him a little bit more carefully in this A.B. 0-1. Splitter swung on and missed 0-1. Bases are empty here with two men out. He pulls this one into right. Cruz is there, and it's a very quick inning as the side is retired. Anytime you can win a game, let alone on the road, you have to feel really good about yourself. It's not easy going into that other team's ballpark and coming out with a win, but they did just that. And tonight's ends at a 6-2 finish. The New York Yankees led this game from the third inning on and never wavered. Hal Newhauser gets the win in relief, his sixth of the season.
Colby Allard pitched well allowing only two earned but ends up taking the loss. So that's a wrap here tonight. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and Heidi Watney, this is Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, find us on Twitter, at MLB The Show. Our final line score tonight, first for the victorious Yankees, Six runs on 12 hits. One error, they left 12 men on base. For the Rangers, two runs, seven hits, no errors, they left 11 men on base. Time of the ball game, three hours and three minutes.